Did you get one of these in the mail? The state is sending out postcards that look just like that to let some Michigan taxpayers know they won't be getting a credit they have counted on. 7 Action News reporter Cheryl Choden is live in Southfield tonight. And Cheryl, what's this all about, really? Well, Carolyn, it's about a law that passed last year but went into effect this year. It's about the Homestead Property Tax Credit. It is about the state of Michigan trying to ease the budget deficit. This is going to make a big impact. George DeFore of Redford is one of about a half million people in Michigan who received this postcard in the mail, a notice of changes to the Homestead Property Tax Credit. These people are on a fixed income. They can't afford at this particular point to lose a credit like that. What it means is you might not be getting that Homestead credit anymore, and if you do, it could be a lot less. I think there are going to be a lot of taxpayers and uh, property owners that are going to contest this because it is we have had such a financial mess with our real estate so many houses underwater so many houses taken back by the banks and it, at this particular point i really don't see how this is going to give relief to middle class america or lower middle class america those most affected will be seniors 65 and older taxpayers with a household resource of over $50,000 and those whose property has a taxable value of over $135,000. I think the big change is changing the verbiage from household income to household resources because now anybody living in the home their income is included plus some exemptions were taken away so it's it's harder now to get that uh, exemption. This is all part of an effort to ease the state's budget deficit. The treasurer's office says the postcards were sent so home Homeowners will be fully aware of the changes as we start to gather information for our tax returns due in April of 2013. I think it's a good heads up. It's, you know, at least it starts the conversation now with your CPA or accountant. At least they're sending you a notification. Right, but that's, that's the way notifications are usually sent, after the fact. And this is something that really should have gone on the ballot. So again, like you heard the experts say, if you got one of these postcards, and even if you didn't, it's a good time to talk to your accountant or your financial advisor. Also, you can go to the website for the Michigan Treasury Department, and you can go to our website at WXYZ.com, and we'll tell you how to do that. In Southfield, I'm Cheryl Choden, 7 Action News.